2000. I think this album has to uh, be the best started. And Mr. Underwood, never got came up. This is about the youth this year. Okay. Oh, then my dog on thing. I ain't gonna mess it up. Matter of fact, I just made it. This is how we build in the village. <laughs> and the generation and let you down. That's all down. To, to regenerate means to make a radical change. Destroying rebuilding. Reconciliation. The Sankofa. The Sankofa is the African bird. The African proverb of the Sankofa bird is facing forward but always looking backwards. That's important to knowing your ancestry and your history. And to honor the ancestors. That's also our story. If y'all got water, I want you to uh, get your water out. We're going to do something called lot. If anybody ever drink, drink before the older people, uh, when you pour out a little liquor, that was libation. Well, nothing evil about that. All right, Juneteenth is symbolic of giving honor for what our ancestors endured and getting here. Without them, you or me wouldn't be here. Who knows the story of our ancestors, Harry Tutton? Uh, <laughs> she she helped slaves get free. She helped almost a thousand. She would have helped. A million more, but they didn't know they were slaves. I want to say I shame to the uh, ancestor here. Yeah. Bear with me. All right. Uh, June 10th was originated in Texas, June 19, 1865. The people of Texas were informed years later that the proclamation from the executive of the United States that all slaves were free and that the Labor Act, they should have been receiving pay and land for their labor. Translated today's comparison, it would be like your mother and father working on a job classified as salary and told that your hours are nine to five. They give an assignment that is impossible to finish eight hours. But the employees require them to work over to nine for the same pay. We were still enslaved in the mind, mental slavery, economic slaves. We were not only promised reparation for land, four the eggs and the mule, but with four the eggs and food, food. We were promised jobs. Only 34% of blacks in America own businesses. We make up almost a minority of America, 13.2%. The Hispanics are growing at 17%. We built America. It's a must that we start generation, generational businesses and pass down generational wealth. Y'all, need, we need our young women and our young men. And the abuse of our kids got to stop. And the, the, the killing of females got to stop. And suicides is out of mental health. We need help. It's important to learn our history. We had religion, spirituality before they they came and got us. They didn't get no degenerates, no heathens, no rich from Africa. They got doctors, scientists, great builders, teachers, explorers, kings, queens. Thank you. Who know who Ma- Massa Musa was? Massa Musa was a billionaire in Africa before Steve Jobs, before Bill Gates. All right. Wow, kids, I want. I need the kids come up. I got some on to give away. Kids, come up. All right. Can you tell me? Come up here. <laughs> You know who Martin Luther King was? 
Martin Luther King. Who know who Martin Luther King was? Martin Luther King. Martin Luther King. You know who he was? What was his speech? What was he famous for? What speech? I had a dream speech. Good job. Give my hand. Give my hand. All right. All right. Does anybody know who Marcus Garvey was? Marcus Garvey? He was a pan Africans. All right. Uh, you know who Malcolm X was? Anybody? Anybody know who Malcolm X? Like you know. You no, know, we got to know about our history. Y'all help him out, I thought. You know who Malcolm X? Malcolm X. Who was he married to? His queen. Queen, just important as the man. Yeah, I love it. He didn't beat him. All right. The next person to do that is. Who was here at Tucker? Tell me. Who was she? What did she do? How did she help people? I didn't talk to her. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. You stay back here. Underground Railroad. She. She didn't want to pause there, so she walked you back all the way from Canada, all the way to Deep South. You know, Deep South. Thank you for being here. Give my hand. Right. Who was Rosa Parks and where was she from? Anybody? Yeah, I had a friend. Rosa Parks. When the the morning thing is like the question of that. Right. What was your phone? I was like, 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 I was Nat Turner, not Nate Turner. Nat Turner. Just in the movie. You took the name of the movie. Oh, okay. Yeah, Nate. Nat Turner. Oh, you better go. Okay, yeah, sorry, T-shirt. Yeah, they killed him. Who was that? I mean, Nat Turner. Who was that? Nothing got me. Got me. Q, come on up, Q. I want to give y'all give a hand to Q. This young man inspired me. All right. Yeah. 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 Who was our first African American president? Raise your hand. That's the truth. The black man never had Lincoln. They don't have it. Uh, Barack Obama, man. Everybody give a hand. Do something over to him. I ain't going to do something over to him. But uh, I, I just give, give kids a hand, period. Yeah. 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 
the young kids in the music, young queens, queens, queens. And last, uh, make sure y'all buy black, support black babies. Got now go please. Thank, thank you, Mr. Mr. P for coming out. And what what other black babies we got out here? Sam Jones, huh? Oh, thank you, Miss Hunt. Give, give Miss Hunt another hand. Thank you.